Hello everybody, my name is SolidWeb and welcome to the new series what I decided to start here on YouTube, which I will call Tower Defense Tuesdays. So basically what we're gonna do here is that we play Tower Defense games every Tuesday. At least I try. <laughs> try to try to make them in time. Hopefully I do. I apologize if I can't do them in time, but yeah. The, for the first tower defense game because I really love them so that's why I decided to do this and hopefully I get some material to YouTube because I have got a little actually a huge break after the last video and this one hopefully I can get more videos in the future a little bit faster face so you can get and try and enjoy them but anyway for the first game well, I'm gonna try here or play I have played it or completed it when it wasn't st yet on Steam, it was still at the Armor Games website. So it will be Kingdom Rush. I really liked it then, I really love the graphics, I really love the idea of this game, and almost everything about this. So yeah, without any other blobbing and nonsense, well I otherwise would say, just let's go to the game here. I have played it a little bit there, I have 14 stars, but never mind that, that I think there's only like one. Let's go back to the new start here. Yeah, this is the menu here. The start, we will start here. I try to explain it a little bit though, I'm pretty bad at that yet, so... I hope you understand, I, and I hope you enjoy! So, campaign. Greetings, noble heroic warrior. As a general of His Majesty's forces, King Jena's recovery requires your services. The inhabitants of the city of Southport have reported attacks by highwaymen and other roaming outlaws. You must take a battalion to Southport to bolster the city's defense. Good luck, General. So apparently we're the general here. That was a nice text over there. Story little. Let's go to the battle. So what do we have at the start? Okay, we have intro introduction here. Objective, protect your land from the enemy attacks. Build defensive towers along the road to stop them. Don't let enemies pass this point. Build towers to the defense your own. Earn gold by killing enemies. Yes, skip. Uh, I probably will skip them. I already know them. So, if you like this game after this, or if you want to go watch other videos and like this after that, you can watch this if you want, but I'm gonna skip them. I know them already. Uh, I, I mean skip, not next. <laughs> so, there is a incoming wave, goblins. If I remember right, you can start the first wave and after that... Let's just build something here. Let's... Let's put oranges there and... You guys, there I can choose here where they are standing. This is the range. I'm gonna put the middle of the road. Archers will shoot for that range there. I don't yet have upgrades for these towers. You will get them while you progress. What should I put here? This would do lots of damage. It's really, really slow, but lots of damage. Uh, mages cast armor piercing bolts at your enemies ignoring any physical protection. That might be good, so let's put that there. So if there comes armored units, we get a little bit of those. And let's just start there. We have a new enemy here. Goblin, small evil humanoid with no outstanding abilities. Low health and average speed. And there's a picture of them. And there they come. They're trying to rush through my mighty defense here. And you can start uh, the next wave if you want, when there comes the skull over there. There starts the stim timing, I will show it when the next one comes. I'm gonna put... oh, I don't mind. Oh, as you can see, there goes the timing. Uh, if you choose to put the new one coming, you will get some extra gold, as you saw there. Reinforcements. You can summon troops to help you in the battlefield. Reinforcements are free and you can call them every 10 seconds. There they are, so I will try to put them there. They are farmers right now. If I remember right, they stand there for a certain time. It was probably 10 seconds, maybe a little bit longer, or so long that they die. I don't remember which was it. Let's just put the other one 
It's a little bit boring here. More, more, more of you. You can defend the place there. Um, we're gonna put these guys there. Uh, I can't put anything else there. Well, that's fine. Another one. We can we can handle them. This is a normal mode, by the way. I forgot to say that. I'm sorry. Tips. Armored enemies. Some enemies wear different levels of armors that protect them against physical attacks, resist damage from archers, and... <laughs> Never mind about that. That's a basic barracks. Armored enemies take less damage from marksmen, soldiers, and artillery, so they are basically just as soldiers. Okay, I'm sorry about that. There we go, huge orcs. Can I check the enemies there? Orc! Tough savage with light armor. Light armor and slow speed. Alright, so they are not as slow as the goblins, but they have a little bit more armor than they. So basically these guys do a little bit less damage, but... Uh, the good thing is that we have the mage over there. A tip again, command your troops. You can choose your soldiers rally point to make them defend a different area. Select the rally point control. Select where you want to move your soldiers. I already told you that. But we will accept those lovely, lovely instructions what they gave us with joy. Never yeah, there. So basically the thing here is that each of these can block only one orc, so if there comes too many of them, they can't block them, as you can see. But these guys kill them too fast, so ah, we need more. Rain of fire, blast your enemies with fire from the skies. Rain of fire is best saved for an emergency or a great opportunity, since it has very long cooldown. That was pretty uh, strange how I said that opportunity there, but never mind. So I can show you this. It's a meteor strikes. Meteor strike. There we go. It kills all the enemies. It doesn't actually kill them. It does a major amount of damage. Oh, they're trying to escape. Uh, let's put you guys in the middle of that. I have lots of money now, so I can just put these guys here. Oh, hey, I want dwarves. I wanted them though here, and I want archers there. Oh, I like that. Oh, okay, I already won. Never mind then. I'm gonna say that next time. Or I can just continue here. I like the uh, voice acting here, what it is. It's pretty hilarious. So, after you beat the game, you get upgrades. Like here, you can upgrade your archers, your um, soldiers, your mages, your artillery, and also your two strikes here. This here shows how many points they need for the upgrade. You can get one point depending how well you did that. As you can see, I just completed that one with three stars, so I got three points. Um, I'm gonna go with better soldiers and maybe with better mages so I can get the armor units there. Yeah, I'm gonna go with spell soldiers there. Fast so they can block the enemies and the can I actually interrupt these because When you go to the map you can interrupt like you can explode sheeps and stuff I don't know uh, Yeah, and after you complete the map you can go for the heroic and iron challenges here heroic is basically Upgrade level one and well, there's this challenge rules no heroes and upgrade level one and iron is that there is only one health, if I remember right. You can't use those, you can use only these. And if I remember right, the iron challenge has that, that you have only one health. If I'm not sure, does this thing. I'm not gonna go for that right now. I'm just gonna go for this guy. Next map, which is. Thank you everybody for joining the first Tower Defense Tuesday where we played Kingdom Rush. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, remember to leave a like and if you haven't yet subscribed me and you want to see more of my videos, remember to subscribe me. And also, if you want, you can follow me on Twitter where you can find more information about coming videos on YouTube and also my coming future streams, which at the moment are coming a lot. This video went, I played a little bit longer than I was. <laughs>
trying to. So this video, first episode, will be about three or four videos long, which I will upload here each and every day, not every Thursday. Every Tuesday will be a new tower defense game, and I try to finish this game for you. Anyway, hopefully you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video. Thank you, and bye bye. Salut,